Music has been, uh, for most of our human history, a communal experience. It hasn't been a performance-related experience. It's been something we all do together. There's not performer and listener. And I think that's one of the reasons drum circles are getting so popular. You're able to bond with people on a different level. And it's nonverbal communication. So if, even if the person doesn't speak the same language as you, you're, you're playing and interacting and you're having a dialogue with them. It doesn't matter if it's in Iceland or Norway or Korea or Australia or New Zealand. It doesn't matter. Anyone can drum. It draws people in. People who are resistant can't fight the groove. They're tapping their fingers and their feet to it. It permeates us. We are all made with rhythm. We are wired for rhythm. From our heartbeat, to our breathing, to our walking, to our sleeping and waking, our circadian, our respiratory, we are wired for rhythm. My first drum, but I tied the drum when I was baby. But the drum is in the house. We make the drum, my family make the drum. That time, I don't know if this is drum, but I'm touching. When I'm no, I know something, I have like six, seven years, I try to play little bit, little by little. Uh, when I have a 10 years, I learned the drum. When I have a 12 to 15, I start to play with my brothers, my family, to the baptism, to the weddings, to the ceremony, little ceremony. I use the drum circle as a tool, as an intervention tool, to work with the children at risk. Because what I found is that the drum gave a voice to those things that cannot be expressed. Every time there's a surgery, the, the, the tumor does come back. Okay, and it's there right now, in fact, and it's always in the same place. Um, so I think my doctors are pretty amazed that, for one thing, I shouldn't be able to have this conversation at all, but here we are. Right? Again, I, I, I'm, I'm sure it's about the rhythm. I'm absolutely sure about the rhythm and the drumming. It's a big medicine for me. Yeah, the, the doctor, the, no hospital can help that. No, 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 no. That's the sound, that's it. It's amazing to see the joy that it brings to them in their everyday life. It stops the shaking. Pitter patter, pitter patter, pitter patter, boom. George. <laughs> George. <laughs> Are you going to tell us who George is? George is my husband <laughs> of 54 years.